Welcome to Simple Cooking with Eric. And I'm just going to show you a quick tutorial how I fry chicken. Everybody fried chicken differently. And then, you know, I was looking at a lot of tutorials on um, YouTube. Everybody want to do buttermilk fried chicken. But let me tell you something. When you're on a budget, or you're getting your SNAP benefits, or you're a single parent, wherever your situation might be, buttermilk is high as I don't know what. People do not have the money to be spending soaking no chicken in no buttermilk and waiting a day or two before they can fry. All of us know, I grew up in the house, so listen, it was flour, grease, your chicken, and some seasoning salt. So, but I'm going to show you how I fry chicken a little different than a lot of people. So I have my chicken, and all I'm going to do, I'm going to sprinkle some seasoning salt on both of them. Before I said, that's a lot, Eric. It is. I got, I got a little parsley. And, and listen, people, season your chicken the way you want to. You can't go by the way somebody else seasoned their chicken. I got a little paprika. I got some garlic powder. And I got some oregano. Now all I'm going to do is mix this up with my hand. My hands are clean, you all. I got my grease going on in here, getting hot. As you all can see. And I'm going to set this to the side. I ain't letting it marinate for no hour, overnight, and all that. I'm going to set it to a side. Let me wash my hands. Now, let's prepare a flop. Now, this is the, the, the my trick. So I have three cups of flour in here. Now, if you want to, you can best and use some what? Buttermilk blend. This is some powdered buttermilk. That's in it if you want to add that buttermilk flavor. And I'm going to put one third of a cup of this buttermilk blend in my flour. Y'all see that? One third of a cup. Then I'm going to add a tablespoon of baking powder. See that? Now, and this is what gives chicken that crunch, cornstarch. I'm going to add a third of a cup of cornstarch if I can get it in there. Third of a cup of cornstarch. And y'all, this is the alternative to all that half buttermilk. This is why buttermilk costs a quart, maybe like two, two close to three dollars a quart. This is about three something, and you can have this. It won't go bad if you're going to fry a lot of chicken. Also, you use it for your cornbread. And then, I'm going to add all them same spices that I added on the chicken. I'm going to add in this flour. Make sure. It ain't going to be that salty, trust me. My oregano. My paprika. Y'all, this is why I fry chicken. My garlic. And my parsley. That's all to it. We ain't had to let no chicken marinate overnight. We ain't had to spend all that, waste all that good buttermilk. We ain't got to dip it 50 million times. This is the way. And then I'm just going to whisk this together. So my flour is seasoned, my chicken is seasoned. I got my grease hot. Let's see. OK. 
Okay, the grease sugar. Now hold on. Listen to all of my subscribers. I'm having a Christmas contest. If you each subscriber of mine, the one that get the most people to subscribe to my channel, by December the 12th, my birthday, I'm going to draw the person, mention the person live on Facebook. I'm going to make something December the 12th of this year on my birthday. And I'm going to personally cater, personally cook, cater your Christmas dinner. And what I'm going to do, you can win me a chef for the day. Now, if you're the winner, if you don't want me to do Christmas, you might have a party or whatever coming up in the uh, after Christmas or New Year. I'm going to personally come and prepare dinner for you for up to 20 people. Now, I need subscribers. So anyone that you get to subscribe to the channel, make sure that they leave a comment and say, um... Like uh, one of my subscribers is uh, Cookie, Excel Wheeler. Ex um, Cookie, I'm going to say Cookie. Cookie on 107. She knows who she is. So, Cookie, if you get some people to subscribe, all you got to do is tell them, they'll put in the comment that they're a new subscriber and that they subscribe because Cookie told them. And wherever which one of my subscribers get the most subscribers by, I think I said September, the end of September will be the winner of the Christmas, uh, uh, me coming to your home, catering your Christmas dinner, or a party up to 20 people. Um, and you could kind of choose the menu. I think our grease is ready. So, my hands are clean, you all, and it's my chicken, but they're clean. And all this, all you, this is all to it, you all. Let's make sure. I ain't measure out no grease and all that. Like, you know, some of them uh, tutorials, they tell you who they measure the grease. Look at that. It's nothing to it, you are frying some chicken. It don't take a rocket science, and you ain't got to spend all that money on no buttermilk, and you ain't got to prepare fried chicken the night before. It's just simple as this. See? And you don't want to overcrowd your, your whatever you're cooking it in. Now, so we're going to let that cook for about... 12 minutes, then we're going to turn it over and let it cook some more. Can you get over here? So you see, now I'm going to kind of just turn our, turn our chicken over. You know it's deep frying. And then I'm going to put this top on it. Then I'm going to let it fry. And I'll get back with you. So, let's take a look at our fried chicken. Look at nice and crispy that is cooking up. Look how fried chicken you are. Look at that. I'm gonna let it cook for about three more minutes. Oh, don't turn off. Listen, don't forget to subscribe to Simple Cooking with Eric on YouTube. Continue to watch the videos. Continue to show your support. I appreciate it. I got the babies. Now the babies are all woke. So you know I'm going to end this quick. That go Mackenzie. Say hi, Mackenzie. Hey, Simple. Hey, Mackenzie, Wednesday. Hey, look at that. And look at Mariah. She's not feeling well. Say hi, Mariah. Brian, she's not feeling well today. So, 
you know, um, I'm in here cooking dinner and I just wanted to show you all how I fry chicken. I'm going to take it out of the minute. I want to kind of show you all how juicy it is. Look at that. Simple, you all. You want that buttermilk flavor? Do just like I told you to do. That way you ain't got no waste. It's no waste. Okay, let me get it. I'm gonna get it. Hold on, you all. Mariah, talk to the people. I want you all to see how juicy this chicken is. I'm gonna send a shout out to um, Curtis uh, Neal in St. Louis. He's been keeping up with my videos. So I want to thank him for the support. His aunt is 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 one of my dearest, closest friends. Probably one of my best friends. Uh, Bertha Frown is aunt. His mom is a dear friend of mine. Roberta, who's a spiritual person, so. You know, I want to send a shout out to him. Uh, let him know I appreciate him watching and supporting. Then she gets started now, you all. I just want to show you all how juicy that is. Let me hurry up so she gets started. Now look, can you get a close up? Okay. See how moist and juicy it is? Look at that juice, and it's done, look. See that? So, don't forget to subscribe to Simple Cooking with Eric. Leave me a comment at simplecookingwitheric at gmail.com. You can email me. You can follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Listen, don't forget to hit the bell so you can be notified every time I put up a new video. I appreciate you all support and watching. And um, until we see, see each other again, remember to be kind to each other and treat each other well. Until then, God bless. And don't forget Thanksgiving. Five subscribers will be chosen live on Facebook. December the 20th, I mean, October the 21st, I'm going to go live, but I'm going to go live on Facebook and YouTube. I finally figured out how to go live on YouTube. I'm going to go live on both, and I'm going to support five subscribers' name, and they will have their Thanksgiving dinner catered by me with all the fixing. And these person will receive enough food up to 20 people. That includes a whole turkey, a whole... Glaze, honey glaze ham. I'm going to make my special glaze. A pound cake, a peach cobbler, dressing, macaroni and cheese, a vegetable, green beans or green, proper green beans or greens, and uh, sweet potatoes by me, prepared by me. So continue to support. I love you all from the bottom of my heart. Peace.